This video will contain a brief explanation of uh, the phenomena called the Doppler effect, as well as what causes it. The Doppler effect is when a transmitter of sound and a receiver moves relatively to each other, uh, making the receiver perceive the sound as of either higher pitch or lower pitch than the original depending on how they move relative to each other. To better understand the Doppler effect, we'll present a few examples, starting with one with stationary transmitter of sound, as well as stationary receivers of this sound. These lines you can see represent the wave tops of the omitted sound. Since the plane is stationary, the wave tops will be of equal distance to each other, both in front of as well as behind the plane. This causes the sound and pitch of that sound perceived by the receivers to be the same in front of as well as behind of the plane. In a way you could call this the plane's, the plane's sound's actual frequency. Okay, so here we have the exact same plane as shown before, but this time it is uh, in the air and it is in motion, moving that direction. And we can see that the sound waves, uh, the wave tops now are uh, closer to each other than before uh, because the plane is uh, Catch, uh, catching up on uh, uh, the last wave top it emitted, so um, the sound waves will now occur much more frequently uh, as in a higher frequency and will be, be uh, perceived by the receivers uh, as a sound with a higher pitch. And uh, the exact opposite will happen if you are standing uh, behind the plane, since uh, the plane now is increasing this, um, uh, the space between each uh, wave top, uh, making the wave tops occur much less frequent and uh, as in a lower frequency, which will be perceived as a low pitch sound. So when the plane passes you, you will, you will experience a sound like, uh, like this. The same phenomena also occurs when the transmitter is sta stationary but the receiver is uh, moving towards or away from the transmitter. But this time, but in this scenario, the, the actual wavelength doesn't alter in any way, but it's only how the receiver perceives the wavelength that is changed. Because he will uh, face the wave tops either faster or e either with a higher with a higher fre higher frequency or lower frequency depending on if it's running towards the transmitter or away from the transmitter. 